At mga kausap natin ngayon, si The Truth, the one championship heavyweight title holder, Brandon Vera. Yeah! So welcome to The Score. Thank you for bringing the belt. Of course, Ang of course. Ang bigat pala niyan. Opo, <laughs> opo. Yan palang workout na pag binitbit mo sa, sa ring. Oh, 12 kilos oh, na ako. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's break down this fight, of course, first uh, with the Deki. Um, two years siyang hindi lumaban. Uh, what did you know of him? Uh, paano mo siya pinag-ingatan at pinaghandaan? Kasi normally you fight against guys who are also active and you get to scout their recent fights. But this guy virtually coming in unknown from the dark for you. Oh, yun talaga mahirap sa kanya. Mm. Yung sinabi mo totoo, he's unknown. Yeah. Um, wala siyang mga films online. Oh. Hinahanap ko talaga mga... Fights. No fights online. Hinahanap ko talaga. Oh. We called the organizations uh -huh. that he fought for before. Ayaw bigay talaga yung what? yung film niya. Yung 70 record. <coughs> ayaw, ayaw. Siya dati, yeah. Oh, ayaw wow. bigay. So, yung yung nakikita ko lang online is lahat yung mga grappling matches niya. Okay. Gi, no gi, yung ng competition sa sa Abu Dhabi. Mm -hmm. So, you know, our world is small. The fighting world is small. Yeah. So, tinatanong ko lahat mga coaches ko, Kilala mo to si uh, Hideki Seki, lahat sila nagugulat. Shrek? Oh, you're fighting Shrek? You're fighting Shrek? Si so, Shrek, uh, alam talaga si Shrek. Alam, alam niya sa, alam siya sa, sa buong Jiu-Jitsu and MMA world. world. Uh, Shrek. So, okay. sabi nila, Brandon, he's tough. He's really tough. Like, he's really, really good on the ground. He's yeah. really, really good on the ground. So, yung game plan namin is, don't go to the ground with Shrek right. until he's tired. Okay. So, yun talaga. And then, everything we did was based on that game plan. Mm -hmm. Stay away from him. Ingatan natin muna first round, second round. Yep. Let us let us pawisan muna. Let's make right. sure we're super sweaty yep. when we have to go to the ground. And uh, that's that's how we played it. Because mm -hmm. parang wala nga eh. We didn't know what he was doing or how he was training. You look very patient <clears throat> in the fight. Uh, middle of the first round, you made some contact already. Sapul na siya yung sipa mo, yung tuhod mo, which <coughs> broke his nose, right? Yeah. Uh, but you didn't, you know, you didn't lose control. You didn't go right after. You tried, but you didn't go crazy. Ano yung, yung maturity mo at that point na sinabi mo sa sarili mo, teka lang, uh, let's, let's wait for the better moment or the right moment. So, Alam mo po, hindi ako yun. Hindi ako okay. yun. Yung coaches ko yun. Okay. Sinabi na sa so akin. So actively yeah. telling Act you to ease up. I can hear them. Okay. Brandon, hintay wow. ka muna. Relax ka muna. Relax ka muna. Taka. Taka okay. muna. Yeah. Huwag muna. Huwag muna. And then, I just listened to my coaches pull back. Okay. Taka. Mm -hmm. Hintay muna natin yeah. to. And then he said, don't go to the ground. There was one point in the film uh, during the fight mm -hmm. where... He he tried to take me down yeah. and then he went to the guard. Yeah, I saw and that. And yeah. almost, you know, I almost followed him onto the ground. Okay. But my coaches were screaming, "No!" So your instinct was to normally go down as well. Oppo. Uh -uh. But <laughs> young coaches, I could hear them, "No, no, not no, this guy. Yeah, no, <laughs> let okay. him up." Okay, okay, okay. So okay. I backed up. Yun lang yung actually, yun lang yung galos mo. That's the only scratch, right? When he attempted to, to grab you. Opo. Because he didn't hit you in the face or any part of the body. Hindi po. But he almost got you. Almost, opo. What would that have been for you? Yung, yung sabi mo nga, there was that moment that you were against the, the, cage. the cage as well. Opo. Na naramdaman mo yung lapad niya. You felt how wide he was. How strong he was. And strong, okay. Uh, sa loob, sumiga ako parang mabae. <laughs> sa loob, parang like, oh, don't go to the ground. Hindi okay. pa muna, hindi pa muna. So, I was nervous. And then, uh -huh. Um, I was so nervous, I didn't realize that I broke his nose. You didn't see it? I didn't know. Okay, kasi walang dugo eh. Hindi, walang yeah, dugo. Right, Inisip right, ko lang, yeah. oh man, he almost took you down. Ingat ka muna, ingat. Okay. Taka muna. Uh -huh. So, I I didn't even know I broke yeah. his nose. And then it was that kick, that left kick, that you know, before this ground and pound. Uh -huh. Na solid dito, di ba? What would you call that? Anong, anong part na katawan niya tinama mo? You know, usually it's a liver kick or yeah. a kidney kick. Uh -huh. But this one, direct yeah. was straight flat on uh -huh. the stomach, yep. and I've never, fl I've front. never kicked anybody in front. He turned a bit, oh, so perfect timing. He twisted, and here you come. I delivered it. Uh -huh. Never in my life have I kicked anybody there. Okay. Ever. So your whole left shin, pretty much, made contact with this whole midsection. Whole midsection, of course. <laughs> normally, for you know, a strike, just just a fist, my bigat na yon oh, oh. in the bread basket, so to speak. Si papa. Yeah, Tuhod si papa. Pa. And he's not if you're not. Ready for it. Hindi nga, oo. Hindi siya handa, oo. So, How do you say shin in Tagalog? Ala... I have no idea. Oh, let's, let's, call a, let's call a friend. Ano shin sa Tagalog? <laughs> I don't know. Give it to us in a bit. <laughs> He'll learn. But anyway, so that was it. When you saw that contact, alam mo na yun na yun. Al alam lang. ko na. Narinig ko. Uh, he exhaled real loud. Ah, <sighs> and I nakita ko sa mukha niya, nasaktan uh, siya talaga. Yeah. Uh, so I just knew, then I knew, follow, yeah, finish, finish. finish oh, tapusin na natin to. Okay. Wala and then from then on, because you went on the ground. So doon, hindi ka na natakot to go ground. Hindi po. Kasi uh, alam ko, 
nasakta na siya eh. yeah. Iniisip niya recovery instead mm-hmm. of jujitsu. So, right, right. sinundan ko na sa ground. There it was. And then, you, you clinch your, your title defense. No po. How did that feel? How sweet was it? Uh, Kung, parang kumanta ka nata ng Merry Christmas. So, <laughs> buti ka na. But seriously, I mean, you know, last year you fought here as well, di ba? And then, ito, your first defense in the Philippines. Anong pakiramdam? You, you kept talking about it leading up to this fight. But when the moment was there, you know, and everybody anticipated, you know, you can't deny, people came to watch you for the main event. What was it like? I, I, it's indescribable po. Kasi, bukod pa nanalo ako, I am officially Filipino na. Right? I have my, I am a, Fili- I'm a dual citizen awesome. now. Awesome. So, you, it means more to me now than before. Yeah. And I, I don't know why, and I cannot describe it, but, parang nananiginip pa rin ako. <laughs> like, I still haven't woken up. Yeah. And, yeah. and, I heard the crowd, diba? they were chanting my name. Vera! Vera. Yeah. So, buong career ko, I never ever heard Seriously? that before. Seriously? Ever in my life. Wow. Kahit anywhere. Uh-huh. So, it, it means a lot more. Yeah. Parang I just fell in love with my kababayan uh-huh. even more. Yep. So, so, for you, that moment overtook the you beating Shrek, you know, that, that, that that enjoyment of the moment with the fans it over, it was better than actually winning wow. the title the very first time galing, galing, galing. Oh, but you know this is no joke you've worked hard for this you oh, know oh. you've you've resuscitated your career you found your your place in the philippines and with one uh how does the future with one look like for you i mean what are you excited for in terms of moving around you said you <coughs> might not only just fight in philippines pero baka ibang bansa ka panlalaban oh nga po uh, last year gusto nila akong lumaban sa oh this year 16 gusto right. nila akong lumaban sa china right right but right. pero ay tinawagan ko nagusto ko may i'm moving plans. to the philippines mm-hmm. so i couldn't but alam ko so buong mundo naghihintay din sila for me to mm-hmm. go fight so mm-hmm. i'm just waiting on one to let me know when uh, their plan was they want me to fight two mm-hmm. or three times this year awesome um, but depending on the schedule, because mm-hmm. you know I'm I'm doing the entertainment business here, right, knock right. on wood, uh-huh. and then uh-huh. having Coming a good soon. time with that. I'm enjoying I'm enjoying the entertainment business. I'm yep. enjoying my acting classes and my Tagalog classes. Mm-hmm. I'm enjoying being in the Philippines. So we'll just take things one step at a time. So yeah, and the next step, which actually literally tomorrow you'll find out your schedule. Yeah, oh, <laughs> po, yeah oh, shooting po. with this woman. <laughs> yeah, uh, with Anne Curtis. What's that gonna be like? I mean, how are you looking forward to doing this movie? You know, when I first met Anne. Uh-huh. Sobrang ganda. Okay. And you know, you, you have this perception that, oh, she's really dainty and mm-hmm. baka maarte and, okay. ay, ako yan, ako. No. Uh-huh. When Anne's training, iba talaga. She's uh-huh. like, I, I could see Anne in the gym training MMA. Really? Ang galing talaga, masipag okay. talaga. And she trains hard. She's so focused. Uh-huh. She, she focuses hard on everything that she does. Awesome. So I, I'm really excited to do a movie with her. And uh, she asked if I would help her on set with her. Uh-huh. Techniques and okay. I said yes. Please help me with mine as well for acting. Please, to lungen mo din ako. Please. Awesome, awesome. Now you all, you're in a great position that you're you're gaining so much popularity. The fans are loving you for representing the Philippines in one, and you're gonna put up a gym, right? So oh, that that's an advocacy part. Of course, is a good business for you personally. But what's it gonna be like for you to share the love and your learning in this sport with your kababayans? Alam mo po in in this business, this tawagan natin game or this genre. Yeah. A lot of people don't like to teach everything because really? it, it happens because okay. they don't want everybody to learn right. everything because true, true, true. you don't want to give away all your secrets. Oh, nga. Yeah. Oh, but ahead, here, oh. I want to create world champions over and over mm-hmm. and over and over and over and over again. I want world champions fighting for the belt from our gym. Yeah. So if we have two heavyweight champions from our gym, I want those to be number one and number two to fight for the belt to become <laughs> a world champion. Awesome. I, I want I want the Filipinos to to have a viable career option in mm-hmm. MMA. Yep. One is here to stay. Yeah, One yeah. is a viable career option. Absolutely. You can, dito sa bansa na to, everybody has heart. Yeah. Everybody knows anong talagang mahirap na buhay. Mm-hmm. Everybody. Yep. You can't teach that. You can't teach heart. You yeah. can't teach somebody how to have a hard, you born hard with life. That, yeah. You're born with it here. Yep. Whether it's tornadoes, hurricanes, or, mm-hmm. or, or bad weather, no food, it's hard. So mm-hmm. MMA is easy compared. Right. I just want to bring my expat coaches to teach the technique awesome. and show them show them a new a new form of life and uh, i'm sure they're all excited to have a chance to learn with you learn from you but before that of course you start putting that in the foundation we want you defending that more Opa. hold that longer yes sir yes sir <laughs> and make us even prouder uh, yes, sir. with one so thanks brandon awesome fight uh, good luck in the movie Maram and salamat. we'll see you again soon thank Maram you thank salamat. you Opa. brandon vera thank you thank you 
Let's keep watching the score for the latest sports updates and don't forget to subscribe to the ABS-CBN Sports in Action YouTube channel.